What's up guys, it's Gago Peters and today I have Maketh with me. So, um, there was this time Maketh went uh, viral, you know, and um, he's doing comedy and the videos were so funny, actually they are so funny and uh, I looked for him to know how we did it and uh, you know to know him as a person and to also know his work. So Maketh, tell us something about you. Okay, thank you so much for welcoming me. And, uh, I don't know how how can I start. Do you want me to start with like uh, how I start comedy or? Uh, no, with uh -huh. your name. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> so my name is Maketh mm -hmm. uh, Edu. I'm a stand-up comedian. Mm -hmm. uh, I do Vine videos as well, mm -hmm. and uh, I I've been doing comedy for f four years mm -hmm. now. Yeah, and then like uh, I started like uh, going auditions for Churchill, mm -hmm. which is what was back in 2018. Mm -hmm. Then I once got a call. Uh, a slot uh, in 2019, which is on May, mm -hmm. it was in uh, Tsiokimao. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's how I start my comedy. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then how far did it go with Churchill? Uh, it wasn't well because uh, my style, uh, my style of comedy, it's different. It's kind of it's a stand-up comedy, and uh, you know Churchill and uh, the Churchill scene, mm -hmm. and the scene I'm doing is so way different because uh, uh, mostly they do like stereotypical jokes mm -hmm. and. Uh, that uh, it's take me like how to like there's stand up and there is what we call a performer so different uh, so I'm different? doing stand up comedy okay. stand up comedy you you have to go for open mics uh, you have to work on your sets and uh, you can do 15 minute set you can do 20 minute set 30 minute set mm -hmm. yeah okay so another thing is that you do your comedy in English right and also in Swahili have you ever done an English in Dinka you know that you are South Sudanese do you do you have like some work in Dinka? Oh yeah, like uh, this is how I started. Mm -hmm. I started shooting videos in 2018, in January, and I, I started with my mother tongue, Dinka, yeah. So I've been doing that for consistently for like uh, one year. Mm -hmm. And then after that I see that uh, I don't have to be local, mm -hmm. I have to make it international, so I do Swahili mm -hmm. and uh, English. But oh. ba basically I do a lot of English content. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Then there was this time you went viral. The the video I knew that it went viral. So the one that I was talking Chinese. Mm -hmm. Yeah, also that. Yeah, I was talking Chinese with my friend. Mm -hmm. That was in 20, 20, 2019 December. Oh, that was a 2019 video. Uh, December. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So anyway, here's the thing. Uh, I've been doing a lot of videos, and uh, matter of fact that uh, you find people like uh, they appreciate your work. Yeah, for sure. And. Uh, Sometimes people need something legit and something authentic. Yeah, the reason why I do comedy, it's, it's something I love and uh, it's, a, it's a craft. So then I started doing comedy, like, because I've been funny since day one. So it's something like in me, so I have to make it at least, okay. make it bigger. Yeah. So that I've been shooting videos, but my aim is to do stand-up comedy, mm. performing live performance. Audience are seated and then I crack jokes. Okay, have you ever like gone to Juba? Yeah. And have you done some gigs there? Yeah, I went to Juba the first time in Juba that was uh, this month. Mm -hmm. I went for three weeks mm -hmm. and uh, I did a gig for Kush and stuff. They were saying Kush and water, I, I cannot remember the gig, but it was for Akau Jambo. Akau Jambo is a comedian. Okay. He's based in Uganda. Mm -hmm. I've been doing comedy for like almost like eight years. Mm -hmm. And he's pretty. He's really doing well. Okay. So, how was the experience back at your hometown? It was okay. Uh, the thing, uh, you know, people have been talking about. Uh, oh, you know, South Sudanese don't laugh at jokes. Uh, but I went and tried. They laughed. Yeah. They really. They have sense of humor. Okay. It's just how, like, uh, sometimes it's a it's a niche, and uh, and if jokes are relatable to them, they're gonna laugh. Like, for example, if I do a comedy in Nairobi, mm -hmm. there's a way I will relate to them. Yeah. When I talk about uh, Sudanese stuff and maybe talk about cows and stuff, they're not going to get it. But you have to bunch in, so you have at least what we call a uh, uh, how do you call a comparison. You compare Kenya and Nairobi, Kenya and South Sudan. Mm -hmm. So that's what I do. That's what you see most of people relate to me. Or I, I do self-deprecation as well. Mm -hmm. I talk about my color. I talk about my height. Uh, a lot of stuff. And I basically I do refugees job because that's where I grew up. Okay. Okay. Speaking of Fiji, there's this uh, this work you did with a comedian, cartoon. Mm -hmm. So you like, and it was really funny though. Like I like the part where she said that um, 
at pesa zako za refugees something like that yeah, yeah. okay was it scripted or is it just something that okay, you it's scripted you know mm-hmm. these things are all scripted and uh, when you script something we script something like people will relate yeah yeah like for example right now when you want to crack a joke about uh, at you know we, i met with jesus people won't it's it's not going to make sense because it, in real how sense did you how did you meet with jesus so okay. It will, it, we, we need something real, realistic. So when you talk about something, it's something realistic. So that's why I say, like, you know, in Kakuma, we are given a card called Bamba Chakula. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's money. Mm-hmm. It's a credit. So mm-hmm. that's why I say, like, just say Pesa Refugee. So oh, so it, Pesa Refugee, you are talking about the Bamba Chakula. Yeah, the Bamba Chakula, okay, yeah. Okay. So we, we want to make it like, because Kenya normally say that Sudanese are being paid by UN, oh. which is a stereotype. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's true. And that's why it's Kaduno was like literally saying that oh, at a pesa, pesa refugee. So, so it's relatable. So when a Kenyan see that pesa refugee, mm. they've been just talking about it. So, so it's be, it will be funny. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It will be funny. That's why it was funny to them. Okay. So so far, what are your ambitions? What are your goals? And where? How how far do you want to go? Okay. Yeah, thank you for asking me that. Uh, first and foremost, when you do something. You have to help the society. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we normally do something to help the society. Yeah, my goal is to bring a comedy scenes, mm-hmm. largely in Africa, mm-hmm. and then most especially from South Sudan, because uh, our, our comedy scene is very low. Mm-hmm. Music, anything to do with the entertainment, mm-hmm. yeah. it's uh, still it's non-existent. Mm-hmm. So my aim is to bring comedy scenes in South Sudan mm-hmm. and bring East African together mm-hmm. with the laughter. Oh. Yeah, that's my goal. Mm, okay, so um, there's this question that we must ask everywhere. Like, um, are you seeing someone, Ama? Just because you have comedy and you know. <laughs> I have a girlfriend. You have a girlfriend. Well, you have a girlfriend. That you have a girlfriend on interview. Where? Oh, yeah, like, why do I have to, like, you know. The thing that, like, I have a girlfriend, yeah, I have a girlfriend. Oh, okay, that girl is like, I'm going to be like, I want to be. You want to ask me how I kiss her? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 that is personal. Keep it that to yourself. Keep no, it that to yourself. Yeah, no, yeah. I know it's a joke. So, another thing is that, um, you know, as a South Sudanese, we are not known for being supportive, you know. We might watch your videos, we might uh, like them, but the thing, like, you're, how do I say it? Like the support, you know, the moral support is usually not like in large amount. What, uh, how do you feel about them? How far do you think your people are supporting you? Okay, uh, let me say this. You know, I cannot blame uh, my people because mm-hmm. uh, we're a ne- we're a newer country. Mm-hmm. We are still working on a lot of stuff. So mm-hmm. on the comedy sector, mm-hmm. it need to be worked so that yeah. at least they appreciate. Mm-hmm. Uh, right now, when you come to Kenya, let me take example of uh, art. Mm-hmm. I'm a visual artist. I do illustration. I do uh, comic. I do like mural. Oh, I do so portraits. Yeah. yeah, that is my profession. Okay, okay. Yeah, I went to school for it. Okay. So people will appreciate art less mm-hmm. than uh, maybe oh. something like uh, maybe let's say like uh, comedy okay. in Kenya. Mm-hmm. So or music. So mm-hmm. when visual like people don't appreciate. So okay. it's the same thing that's happening in South Sudan. So mm-hmm. they still don't know yet what is comedy. Mm-hmm. So the yeah. time that so we are trying to to teach them how mm-hmm. comedy works and mm-hmm. how comedy can help society, mm-hmm. yeah. So I cannot blame them. Even if they don't support me, you have to support yourself first, and then later on mm-hmm. they will support you. You have to prove them that you're so good in this, yeah, you and you can at least bring something to help the society. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, so you mind or not? Ah, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going bored, I'm going hungry, I'm going tweet, I'm going hungry. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay, sir. So, um, you know, you have said that uh, you're a comedian, and you... do you have any online channel, Ama um, Unenda, to for gigs and all? Yeah, I have a, a like a, mm-hmm. I have a my I have Instagram like Maket comedian, uh, uh-huh. Facebook Maket uh-huh. do, uh-huh. uh, uh, YouTube uh-huh. Maket comedian, uh-huh. uh, TikTok Maket do, uh-huh. yeah. So Maket I just Maket. start with Maket. Yeah. So both TikTok and Facebook it's uh-huh. Edu with E double D U. Okay. Uh, the same as TikTok. Yeah. So Instagram is my comedian. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but the whole bunch of my comedians so okay. I've connected. 
So kindly go subscribe and support your boy market yeah, comedians. Go yeah. Subscribe and uh, it's just a little taking time <laughs> to subscribe. Kidogo too, just a click somewhere and it's yeah. done. Okay, tell us one joke before we go. <laughs> oh okay, you want joke? Yeah. Thank you so much for hosting me. Yeah. Uh there's a joke I crack about uh when we were coming to Kakuma, I had a friend, so you know Kenyans they have to ask you why are you going to Nairobi? Do you have legal document? Mm -hmm. Are you going for school and stuff? So mm -hmm. In Kakuma, you cannot go without giving movement pass. So we went with my friend, we were like, uh, you know, we went and we were not given. So we were like, ah, wait, let's just go. Mm -hmm. What we do, let's pretend we're going for a, a, a test, like uh, the test that we used to do in high school. Mm -hmm. Mathematic uh, contest, English and Swahili. Ah. So I, I took Swahili. Mm -hmm. So I was asked, you know, Kenyan scholars garang everybody. Yeah, yeah. So that's they were like, garang, come here, where are you going? Uh -huh. That was like, we're going to Lodwa mm -hmm. for a contest. Mm -hmm. At the contest, Ghani, they were like, we're going for ink, quite Swahili. Mm -hmm. The other one was a Congolese going for mathematics. So mm -hmm. then Mukenya Kasama, where are you Swahili? Kasama, and I leo. Or Kasama, to move in Gali Moja. So Nikasama and Gali Ghani, or Kasama Frimbi. So Nikasama Frimbi, see the race is an cutting area. So Um Guinea. Hey. Um Congolese, uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. I can the I English uh -huh. it only knows from one to ten. Then. So it was us. Come here, baby. Uh -huh. Come for us from number one to twenty. Uh -huh. Only that. Uh -huh. It was counting one, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I can yangali and I juke some eleven. So you can say bro, so chapter ya ya ko nisha maliza. I can say ten one, <laughs> ten two, ten three. Yeah. Yep. You want me to crack like a sex joke? So that, yeah. that is the joke. <laughs> yeah, that's the joke, yeah. <laughs>